The Scottish Parliament is coming to Craig Miller next Monday, May the 18th, and we want your views on how welfare reform is affecting the community. In the area, there's a lot of people on welfare, um, and I know that there's been a lot. There was a lot of um, Probably the first time we saw that the area was becoming much more politically aware was when bedroom taxis came in. There was a lot of posters going up, there was a lot of campaigns, but I believe it does impact a lot of people with the term, types of houses we have, um, and that most of the council houses in the area are two or three bedrooms, so it does impact a lot of people. I think it's uh, affecting people's lives in a, in a negative way. I think they're too much skewed to catching people out. People who genuinely, genuinely need uh, welfare and need help are being um, targeted, I would say. Well, not targeted, but um, they're taking the pressure of, of all the cuts and things. So um, it's very, the actual system itself is not very fair. Personally, uh, there were several weeks when I had nothing and I was surviving on food banks. Uh, and that was for about a month and a half, two months because uh, my ESA was stopped because there was uh, discussion about where I, whether I should be getting it or not uh, and then eventually they said I should be getting it. Housing benefit is a nightmare. If you have an experience you'd like to share, we'd love to hear from you. The Welfare Reform Committee will be at the Jack Kane Centre from 2pm for an informal session. There'll be free refreshments, you can just come along and anyone can have their say. And do you have a view about the Scottish Parliament and politics in Scotland in general? Then come along to our public question and answer session with the Scottish Parliament's presiding officer, the Right Honourable Tricia Marwick MSP, and a group of your local MSPs. It's also in the Jack Kane Centre. Again, you don't have to book, and free refreshments will be on offer.